A slice of bread a day can now help to keep the doctor away. Food Standards Australia New Zealand says all bread sold from today must contain iodised salt rather than normal salt. The National Bakers Industry Association agrees with the plan. We certainly uh, see the need for iodine in people's diet. The new ingredients created mixed reactions among customers. Off the top of my head, I'm OK with it. I guess if it means that people have it and they don't actually have to go and take a pill, then that's a good thing. I'm surprised that they have to mandate that sort of stuff, but yeah, I mean, I haven't got any dramas with it. I guess it's something that I didn't know about, so like a lot of things in food you don't know. The Australian Thyroid Association says almost one in two Australians aren't getting enough iodine, which is essential for a healthy metabolism and brain development. Low iodine intake often results in lower IQs among children and difficulties in women conceiving. Brisbane baker Richard Cotton says the switch has been smooth. Both our suppliers who we get salt from have been adding iodine to their salt for the past eight to ten weeks and we have not noticed any difference in the, in the product. Organic bakers are exempt from the changes. Letitia Willocks, QUT News.